the photo annual of uh, Transwell. It's the biggest issue of the year and uh, do have a front cover. It's, uh, it's pretty special. Makes me emotional. Jeremy Jones going null in Antarctica. Best trip ever. Yeah, there's one of Lucas from Japan. I think uh, this one disappear. Yeah, there's one in of Xavier in Haynes, AK. I met Daryl uh, one day on a contest on the Big Mountain Pro. I think it was in 2006 or 7. He showed me he had a few spots that we should go and hit. And like I said, all right, why not? We like went there and I tried and I remember that in the evening I had this, uh, like this shot from my computer and I was like, wow, this is uh, really special. I don't know, since then I think I've never been shooting with anyone else. For me, the accent is not the most important. It's more the uh, light and uh, that it's clean. I don't want to shoot if there's, there's drags or if, if it looks kind of, if there's no snow in the trees or something like that. It's, it's not for me. Yeah, if, if you shoot freestyle, you get more situations when you can use lights and stuff and kind of make the shot artificially clean and perfect, but shooting big mountain and free riding, it's a, it's a totally different game. Maybe I shoot 60, 70 days and I probably have three really good days per season. So uh, it's, it's not like, it's not obvious that you get a good shot. It's, it can take weeks, months. Every day I go out and shoot, I, I want to come home at least with one good shot. There are definitely times that the pressure is growing and you know that, okay, I don't have the shot yet. Then it's the, uh, just a waiting game and like last year in AK, like that was mid-April. I think in four or five days, I got 20 good shots. Yeah, I just carry uh, pretty much one camera. Normally I have three, four lenses for like a 300 millimeter, 70 to 200, 24 to 70, and uh, normally wide angle, like a 14 millimeter or something. My style is to frame really wide. I really like the way he works, you know, he really concentrates on quality. He's, uh, he's really passionate and he, he spends his time basically thinking of uh, the next shot, what we should do next, and you know, that brings a lot of inspiration and and it's cool because after a while now we we're really used to work together and we exactly know each other you know like when he tells me okay you could do this he knows my way of writing he knows which way I could do it and I know like which way he could shoot it and I basically know <laughs> that I can trust him for that if he tells me go there uh, I know it's gonna be a perfect shot you know it always works you ever get scared in the mountains <laughs> All the time, like after my avalanche, I take it super easy. It doesn't matter for me anymore if I put the first tracks on that couloir or if I'm if I'm the last guy skiing the moguls. For me, it's the uh, the safety is you know, and safety comes first, and that's good because the, our team, Xavier, Guida, we all think same way, and uh, we don't take stupid risks. Even, even people might think, oh, Xavier is crazy, he's pushing it, but it's not like that. It's like, we wait, we wait, the conditions are good, we go there and even, even then we might have to say no and turn back and forget the shot. With Terrell, it's always a banger.